I'm going to make this short and sweet. It's been all over even the mainstream media that Google, Twitter, Facebook, and others have all announced that they're going to censor videos, text, you name it, that is, quote, critical of governments. And the Electronic Frontier Foundation came out today and released a bunch of documents for Homeland Security spying on bloggers and others that are critical of the government. They say that messes up their mission to protect us, so we can't criticize all the naked body scanner deals that former heads of Homeland Security and others are getting, or all the drone deals they're getting. Half of the 60 plus billion they just passed for the FAA over the next five years is for 30,000 drones, including predators and reapers, in our skies. But here's my point. They're admitting that they're censoring. Google admits that owns YouTube that they're censoring under government request. And I personally have had enough of it. I have a, many YouTube channels, but one of them has about 180 million views. And it's just a small part of what I do. With the syndicated radio, over 100 AM and FM affiliates, XM, you name it. But it's the issue that they advertise that if you follow their rules, it's an open commons, it's YouTube, and it's false advertising. Because they have banned so many videos, blocked them, you named it, over the years. And now they've done it again. This video was so incredible that Mike Adams put out, because the globalists don't care if it's crying Miss USA over them abusing her or children crying. They like that fear. Mike Adams did a masterful video making fun of the thuggish behavior and, and, and how these bullies get off on abusing people. It was devastating. It was a perfect 10, five stars. It's titled TSA, his original version of it a few days ago, TSA Help Wanted. We called it basically TSA Bullies. And they blocked it for the general public to see, claiming that it is uh, vulgar when it just shows photos and video of what TSA does to our children and wives and husbands and everybody else. So they're censoring what you can see, and it's all part of the selective enforcement. This is the video that TSA doesn't want you to see because they don't like being made fun of. These authoritarian thugs want to be taken seriously. They want to scare you, but they don't want to be laughed at. And they're scared of this masterwork that Mike Adams, the health rangers, put out. Now, we've got mirrored versions of this at InfoWars.com. He's got the original at NaturalNews.com. Get it and don't let him stop it. It would have been seen by millions of people on our site. But now, on all these other ragtag sites, maybe a few hundred thousand. Unless you get angry and get it out to everybody. Don't let these anti-American, anti-freedom bastards have their way. Okay? They're scared of us. Get this info out. Expose them. We're going to make a lot more satirical videos exposing you as well. All right, that's it. We'll see you back on the radio tomorrow, 11 a.m. Central. I'll try to get Mike Adams to call in or maybe come into the studio and give us his take on this as well. But I even told my guys, I said, we're going to post that and they're going to take it down. It's just too powerful. And they did because they are scared of the truth. All right, that's it.